Welcome to Tamara Tattletales. I'm Tamara and I spill the tea on your favorite reality stars. Married at First Sight Season 13 Houston, the season that just keeps on giving. Gil has been staying active on social media. He's done two lives that were over an hour long. He hopped on Jose and Ryan's live, did a couple of online interviews, and perhaps some other things that I don't know about. Recently, he celebrated surpassing the 100,000K mark on Instagram. I was trying to find a scene where the husbands were talking during the season about what they told the experts they did and did not want in a special. Spouse, I could swear Gil said he didn't want someone who was counting their Instagram followers or cared about that sort of thing, but I couldn't find that scene. Do you remember that or did I just make that up? Anyway, after his first live, he shared his P.O. box on Instagram so fans can send he and hype gifts and whatever else they were offering up. He included a disclaimer that said, please don't feel obligated to send me anything. Of course he got a lot of heat for doing this. Fans did not like the optics of him seemingly soliciting gifts from folks. He replied to the outcry with this post. Y'all are wildin'. I gave out my P.O. box for those who asked so they can send hype some stuff. Cookies, apparel, candles, etc. I never asked to be given anything. This was asked of me. Let's not get crazy because I'll be quick to return to sender. Regardless of the optics, some fans follow through and send him stuff. He's hopped on Instagram a couple of times to do a show and tell shout out slash thank you to some of the gift givers. What up? First and foremost, thank you for the continuous love y'all keep showing me. I love it. Thank you. Kisses to all, hugs, all that, my brothers. Appreciate your love, too. So let's get to it. So y'all keep asking about what people are going to send me my, um, through my P.O. box. So here we go. So first and foremost, I get these lovely Christmas cards, right? Nice and cute. You know, Christmas cards, the holidays. I love it. Hey, one thing, though. Um, if you are going to send me Christmas cards, I appreciate it. I'm very grateful, but let's try to stay away from the glitter though because you know this thing gonna be here till about 2030 glitter don't go nowhere So let's stay away from the glitter, but I appreciate it my people appreciate it All right going with the theme so we got the Christmas cards that I get I also received this wonderful letter This is old school people don't write letters anymore. They write emails they text they don't write letters This is a very sweet um, letter. I got from a fan. They say they don't have social media yeah, but they ran into my P.O. box somehow on Google, and so they decided to write me. That's very sweet. I also got a book. I got two books. I got one from the lovely Valencia Joy. So I'm going to read that book. It's titled, I Met a Guy and Other Things You Can Only Discuss With Your Sister Girlfriends. Um, I appreciate that she considers me a sister. I'm going to read it. And I'm going to give you all a nice little uh, breakdown of the book. I'm not not the breakdown, but I'm going to tell you whether, yeah, it's it's worth it. I'm pretty sure because I started reading a little bit. It's pretty funny. The other book I received is from, I think you guys might know who this is. Um, it's Dr. The Lovely, Dr. Bibiana. So this is her bread and butter. I am definitely going to read this book from cover to cover. Um, I'm excited about that. And I'm very thankful for her for sending me that so I got those two books and last but not least this little bad boy right here this bracelet dope they know somebody knew I like bracelets so this little bad boy right here with this little line in the middle I'm loving it I appreciate that I appreciate everybody that's sending me things that's you know supporting the page like I was saying before I was really cut off. Um, I appreciate you all. Thank you. I'll try to keep posting as much as I can, but you guys know that I am in school, so I got to do a lot of studying. I have a little break, so we'll see if I can post some more for y'all. Don't know when the next live is going to be, so uh, um, stay tuned. Good night, y'all. Mi gente, what's up? So I'm back real quick. Just a quick little snippet. Um, I just want to tag the person that actually gave me this bracelet. I freaking love it. Check it out. You can see it. It got the little line right in the middle. I freaking love that thing. Wow. Right. Um, so it is a black owned business. It's a small business. So if y'all can give them some support, I'm not, you know, I'm not getting paid for this or anything like this. I just want to give out. So I just want to give back to the people that show me love. Go drop some love on their page. Adios. Mi gente, I'm back. Another P.O. Box opening. So, 
Uh, obviously, I get the Christmas cards. Love the Christmas cards. I love them. Look at that. Vacation Christmas card. I'm loving it. I also got the family. What a beautiful family that is. Professionally done Christmas cards. That's what I'm talking about. Look at that. Love it. I love it. And then obviously from the great little state of Rhode Island. I love it. I also got a letter. Another letter. That is old school. That's wonderful. Look at that penmanship. Oh, look at that penmanship. <laughs> it's beautiful. Um, only thing I'm going to ask if when y'all do send me um, these cards and these letters, can y'all please add y'all handles, your IG handles, your IG names so I can personally send you a video. Aside from these shout outs, I will send you a personal video. But other than that, thank you very much. Thank you for the support. And I hope you all have a Merry Christmas and a blessed new year. Before I forget, I forgot one other card. This is from my girl Lydia in Jersey. Uh, thank you very much. Lydia must have just went to Puerto Rico because if y'all know, them Puerto Ricans are proudful people. Just like Colombians, though. I'm not knocking it because she got brought me some goodies with Puerto Rico all over it and some Puerto Rican snacks and little goodies. So I'm going to tear them things up. So, Lydia, thank you very much. Merry Christmas to you. Aside from the letters and the postcards that I'm getting from you guys, I also receive gifts, which is amazing. But y'all know y'all don't have to send me any gifts, but I'm grateful for it anyways. So I'm gonna give y'all a little shout out. So first and foremost, we have the scented, wonderful, delicious smelling candles. I, I love candles. I'm about to move out of this place in two days. So that's the first thing I'm gonna crank on as soon as I get to the new spot. With the candles, I also received some waxes. This is eucalyptus and I got like coconut lime. It's wonderful, it smells delicious. I'm not a wax guy, but now I am. I'm no ambassador, I'm no endorser, but I sound like one. Go show some love. So we continue with this wonderful little opening of these, of my PO box. So next up we have the wonderful and so generous um, Ingrid Senegal. She owns a, uh, a stationary store on Etsy. So you can check her store out. I'm gonna tag her, um, her handle. You can go to her page, and from there, you can go to her XT shop. So she supplied me with all the pins I'm going to need for the rest of my life. Like, I'm set. So <laughs> I'm going to always have a pin. Best believe that. So y'all check her out. Y'all show her some support. It's a small business, the backbone of this country. Show her some support. And just in case y'all thought I was lying about um, my P.O. box and people wanting to send hype some stuff, this man got some treats, look like some organic, expensive treats. So hype does get some stuff too. Um, and this was mainly for him. He also got, I already packed it up. He got some toys too. I thought I had the toys here too. But yeah, hype, he's getting love as well, just in case anybody's wondering. So just a couple things left and we done. So, <laughs> all right, so the next up was, as you know, I was gonna get bracelets. And y'all are flooding me with bracelets. I'm a very simple guy. I rock like one or two bracelets and that's it. But y'all sending me these dope bracelets. Like, look at this thing, man. Look at this thing. With the crown? Come on. Um, so make sure to drop and show them some love. Check them out. Their link will be somewhere up here. My people, so we have the last one. We have a care package from the Bonafide Dream, which includes these beautiful, look at how vibrant these bracelets are. Beautiful bracelets. Also with those bracelets, she sent me some stones, beautiful stones. You know, they say that this stuff brings positivity into your life, a little bit of healing. I personally am not into that, but as you guys know, I'm a very open-minded person. I'm not ever gonna knock anybody for their beliefs, but I'm gonna take it in consideration. I'm gonna try it out and see for myself. So I am very grateful for that. I'm gonna tag her somewhere up here. Please show her some love, drop on her page, show them love just like they showed me love. All right, let's do it. Mi gente. So check this out. I am a, if 
forever grateful for everything that y'all do for me, for sending me stuff, all the kind words. But it is Christmas time. I'm thankful for everything and thank God I have everything I need. I truly appreciate it. But that time and energy that y'all are spending on me, I'm fine. I just had a heartbreak. We all go through that. It sucks, but it is what it is, right? Um, let's let's use that energy to actually help those in need. So whether it's paying it forward at the grocery store, at Starbucks, you know, paying for somebody that's behind you, let's focus on that. Let's do that. So instead of spending that money that y'all would spend on me by sending me stuff, let's do it with those closest to us, our neighbors, our families, our friends. Let's do that, please. And once again, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year's to everyone and their loved ones. I hope y'all enjoyed the time. And please don't put me to work this weekend. So let's uh, be smart. Let's not be in a rush. Let's not get no accidents. Let's all have a good, healthy Christmas and New Year's. God bless. So what do you think about cast members giving out P.O. Box numbers specifically to receive gifts from fans? Let's talk about it in the comments.